So my dad was actually an agency owner and my brother had worked at Liberty National for two and a half years. And so I always said, I'll never get into anything like that because I'm just not much of a talker. But after about six months, they just kept on and kept on prodding and said, hey, I think you would like this opportunity. I think that you would do well in it. And so I came in for an interview. I liked the compensation package as well as helping people at the same time when they were in need. When I first started, I'd been doing it about six months and I was at a local school system um, in our hometown. And there was a lady there that actually taught me school. And so she came in there and she had a cancer policy. And she started talking about, hey, should we keep this? Should we not keep this? And I knew her dad had um, actually passed away from cancer. And she said, well, I think I'm gonna cancel it. But six months in, I didn't know what I was doing. So I didn't know who to tell to cancel it or what. So about a month later, um, I was going to uh, supper with my family and I knew that the phone number that was showing up on my phone was her. I answered and she goes, hey, did you cancel the cancer policy? And I said, no. I said, but my dad can help you with the refund. She said, don't do that. I've got leukemia. And $350,000 later on the cancer claim, that's what we had paid her before she passed away. Uh, this opportunity has provided me at the age of 26 years old to purchase my own house. It gives you financial stability, um, allowing you to help others at the same time, uh, but I don't have to worry about the next bill because of Liberty National.